Hello, Terraria and Fusius. My name is James, and welcome back to the Calamity Mod. So, it's day three, and we're starting today's episode off by addressing one of the most frequent comments from yesterday, and that is about the Ice Temple. So, I didn't actually know that Calamity had an Ice Temple. I believe this is something that was added in, and then I never actually discovered on my last series, because we did, in fact, find one of these and these are essentially what we're about to go get so i walked past it you guys actually pointed it out to me in the comment section because you're all so eager eyed and i love that and i think it's down here i'll have to check right so it's right there and it looks just like the uh, the desert one so they can have some like legendary items in them essentially and i believe they are like hard mode accessories so, having gotten the climbing claws and then whatever else could be in here, I feel like, yeah, I feel like Calamity's really good recently when it comes to uh, to dishing out the items. I didn't make my uh, my hook and I needed to make that. That's what uh, yesterday was all about, was about the hook, and then I forgot today. But I hope you're all doing well. Thank you all for the uh, awesome support over the past two days. I have loved reading your comments. Hopefully, we can keep that up each and every day. Right, let's dig our way into here then. Oh my god, what have I been saying about diamonds in this series? Why do I keep getting diamonds? And why are these all ganging up on me? I'm just trying to mine. Leave me alone. I'll tell you what, now's a good time for rage. There we go. So that's what rage looks like. I mean, I was going to lose it anyway if I died, so... Amazing. What is it with me and diamonds? I did make some uh, some new arrows today. I made some frost burn ones and some regular fire burning ones. I was just gonna, you know, go silent and go mining and then cut it back in in a second. But you know what? If I'm getting attacked like that, it doesn't matter. Huh. Got a lot of money here, haven't we? I mean, that's a lot of money. I mean, two copper and one gold stack. Nice. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, wow. Ten gold. Wow. Twenty-two gold. And a frozen turtle shell. Puts a shell around the owner when below 50% life that reduces damage. That's pretty good. I mean, there were better items, though, to get. Like, you could get a, uh, a blizzard in a bottle. And I would rather have had the blizzard in a bottle any day. Considering, well, I think it was a blizzard in a balloon. Considering that would have been, like, an amazing pickup. I'm a little bit gutted by the, the turtle shell. But what do you guys think? Do you think it's a viable option? I don't actually ever use it. So, it's strange because here I am getting it in, uh, in pretty hard mode. But, you know, usually I wouldn't care. I'd just kind of throw it away. But... You know, free item is a free item. I'm wondering if that, like, area over there can be mined into, or at least, like, will open up into something. I mean, everything's mineable in this game, pretty much. So let's check it out. Let's see how it's doing. So, another pretty regular day. Haven't really been doing much. I started watching a new uh, series on Netflix, which has been pretty good. It's called Maniac. It's got Jonah Hill in it, and I've been enjoying that, but I've got to take it slow. I try not to watch uh, shows all that fast, so, um... Oh, wow, look at this. One heart crystal there and one there. So if you are, you know, a, a, a somebody who has Netflix, might want to check it out. It's pretty good. I mean, when I went shopping yesterday and I went to this big shopping center, like, everywhere had big adverts for it. So it seemed appealing. I'm not going to lie. But maybe check it out. So you may have noticed that in the um, in the speed up section in episode one, I used some music from uh, from Gravity Falls. It was actually a remix by uh, somebody who made a, uh, a Legend of Zelda remix that we used to use in the top five videos. Uh, but anyway, the reason I started using that music is because I started watching the show, but I haven't finished it or got anywhere close to finishing it. Um, but that is why I've been using it. I've been trying to like broaden my horizons. And one of the things that was recommended to me was in fact Gravity Falls a long time ago. So. I've been trying to get into it. Okay, so there's my there's my shell. There's my frozen shell. I did wonder what was happening here. I was like, am I recharging something? It's, I don't know. Okay. Things are getting scary now. No. Yeah, I just I just knew that was gonna happen. And it's it's gonna take my gold, isn't it? You just know it. You just know it. Oh, before I forget, I should probably make the uh, the topaz hook. So I will grab this. I will make the topaz hook. And there we go. I can get around a lot easier now. Okay. Alright, let's get out of there. Let's get out of there. Because it's getting rough, I'm not going to lie. Like, things are getting tense. Alright, so we got some flurry boots. We've already got flurry boots. That's alright. I mean, that's okay. 
Okay, so I want to take a little bit of a look at my world and see if there's like anything out there that, you know, I could find. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to dip dive into the desert because the desert is kind of like a good place to find items. And I have got a little bit more health now, but I could do with like not getting mauled while I'm there because that's usually what happens to me in the desert. Oh, it's actually pretty dark. Okay, what do I get? I got some lead bars and some iron skin potions, so I will take an iron skin. And I'll also take a Spelunker, and we will go on a bit of an adventure together. And hopefully we don't find, like, I don't know what they're called. I'm going to say Snidrians or something. Those little uh, little beasts that actually spawn in the desert that give you uh, victory shards. I'm hoping we don't find any of them. And look, if we find one, I'm hoping it's one of the ones that get completely, like, uh, glitched into the map so we don't have to deal with it. But we're, gonna, we're just going to look through. I could really do with either some gravity potions... If I was to like make a list of all the things I would want, I want a cloud in a bottle. I want some gravity potions. I want some more uh, free like ore. I really like getting uh, free bars if I'm being honest because uh, I don't like mining and I don't like uh, crafting them all up. So when you get like a bunch for free, that's always really good. Um, and I think that's that's probably about it really. I think I'd, I'd be pretty content with just a cloud in a bottle honestly, because then you've got kind of like the ultimate mobility. You've got. A grappling hook, you've got some, you know, tiger climbing claws to just stick onto stuff. And then you can uh, ice skate along. Alright, Stormlians. We should probably kill a Stormlian because we're going to need to kill them at some point anyway. So let's get it out of the way. And these things can be kind of annoying to find. Like, not going to lie, like, I've had some series where I've had to, like, spend ages farming them. Because it's like a, it's a rare drop, what they drop, isn't it? The, uh, the spawner for the thingy. The thingy madoodle that goes in the thingy mabobs. You know, nobody knows what I'm talking about. You all know what I'm talking about. It's all fine. <laughs> okay. Let's kill you, my dude. Hiya. Finishing blow. There we go. <laughs> These things actually take kind of a while to, to kill. Alright, nothing so far. If we do a super zoom out. Nothing on the radar. I see a life crystal down and to the right. We'll go grab that. Okay, that's not what you want to walk into. Just all of this. All of this chaos. Leave me alone. <laughs> Alright, I'll kill this one. And then slimy boy at the bottom. He's got the other two. And then we fine. Okay. Go on, finish him off. Finish him off. Nice. Alright, so what's this going to take us up to? This is going to take us up to 260 health. I feel like we're, like, gearing up for a boss. I'm not going to lie. Like, we've got some decent stuff. I mean, I could probably make a weapon and take down the Eye of Cthulhu. But we'll have to see. I actually can't remember which comes first. I don't know if it's, uh, if it's the Eye of Cthulhu or... It is the Desert Scourge. Okay, so we've got to do the Desert Scourge at some point. I don't know if we'll do that today. Might do that one tomorrow, just to make sure we're all, uh leveled up and stuff but i think i think that's what i'm going to be focusing on is like getting ready for stuff like that okay but you guys are gonna have to let me know if you think i'm progressing too slow let me know if you think i'm progressing too fast let me know i'm kind of like that person that you know in a school right when i was in when i was in college right we had this one teacher and she used to write down her thoughts on the the whiteboard and she would do it so rapidly so it, it'd be a constant struggle to like follow along with what she was saying because it was kind of like a complex uh, subject anyway and, and she would like rattle on and write down all this nonsense right and we had this one designated person in the class i remember and it was their job to make sure that this teacher didn't rattle on too much so they had the awkward moment of being like hey slow down stop and i feel like i need one of those in life i'm not gonna lie because i feel like i have these moments of like pure um pure energy and i'm like boom and i'm rapidly speeding through terraria and i have some days where i'm just dead sluggish and i'm like oh just dead slow and i'm like oh I'll, I'll, I'll have a bit of mining that's why i haven't put vein miner on yet because i'm just like i just fancy some mining today okay zoom out progress report Ooh, i don't know what that is i'm gonna go get that there's another chest here so before we go and get that desert you're looking one let's go grab this one man i need that slime to like just book his ideas up. I'm very thankful for the slime, considering it was a free summon, but he's been very slow today. I feel like he's uh, he's really led me into the path of danger. Like, this dude, he's just bouncing all over. Like, he can't figure out where to go. I mean, I think he needs a bit of a motivational pep talk, I'm not gonna lie. Look, buddy, you can save us. I believe in you, but you need to do it rapidly, because <laughs> I am bad. 
Right, let's finish this dude off. Bam, 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 bam. There we go. Okay, so what do we get? Cloud in a bowl. This is me clapping. I'm actually impressed. Cloud in a bowl. That's what I said that I wanted. I'm very happy. The fact it's menacing. I feel like when I get a menacing item, I'm like, the game loves me. I don't know. What's this? A storm lion mandible. Oh, so that's different. That used to look a little bit different. I'm finding that there's a lot of re-sprites. I really like re-sprites in the Calamity mod. I'm not going to lie. Like, the funny thing is, I don't think Calamity needs to get re as much as it does. If I'm being honest, team, I'm not going to lie. But... I like it because it makes things feel fresh. Uh, that's a really bad way to make things feel fresh. Like, it's not intentionally done. That's not why they're doing it. They're respriting it because, you know, they want to make it better. And that's cool, right? But it actually does make things feel, feel fresh. And I've got a really great example of that. So for every season of the Calamity mod, I've usually used a picture of the hive mind, the boss, the hive mind, right? But in this series, I like I got to use a new hive mind sprite. And for every series that I made, they've changed the hive mind. Now I'm beginning to think that that desert chest. I haven't got a splunk potion on me now. I'm beginning to think it's amongst all of this desert fossil, and I don't believe you can actually. Yeah, it is. I don't believe I'm actually allowed to break it yet. We'll give it a go in a second. Maybe we'll try a bomb as well. Look at you, Amber Crawler. I love you. I've played modded Terraria so much, I can't even remember if crawlers are modded or, um, or like part of vanilla. That's bad, right? I feel like my actual Terraria knowledge goes out the window from playing so much modded. Okay, you can't get in. Oh, that's, that's a little bit gooding. I might do... Let me check. I might actually try and do the, uh, the King Slime fight today because... That's one I know that we can get out of the way, but it only depends on if we have the right bars to do it. And now I'm looking at this, I'm like, hmm, maybe not. Gold bars. How many gold bars do you need? Because you need gold bars and you need rubies, right? Okay. So can I make a... Yep, I can make a gold crown. And then I think it's only 20 slime, right? Is it only 20 slime? Yeah, it's 20 slime. Man, they made, they made that fight so good. Like... They really have. They've made it so chill. But everything changes after we defeat this boss. So it's like, do we do it? Do we not? But I think we should do it. I think we should get it out of the way. I mean, it's not going to be a hard fight. Like, uh, it's very easy to do. I'm not going to lie. Um, and this isn't death mode. So it's not like it's going to be, like, insane. Okay. Snidrian. So this just popped up at the bottom. This is a, uh, a brand new feature in Calamity. I will be honest with you. I do not think this fits the mod. Like, I don't mean to insult this, but it doesn't, right? Because to tell you the truth, it just kind of doesn't. Like, I don't know. It looks like it's, like, um, very technical, and I don't think that's what this mod is like. No, no, fire faster. Stop wasting my rage. Oh, I forget. If you take damage when you activate rage, you lose it. Okay, I'm hoping that Snidrian is going to be so annoyed. Whoa, no, 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 no. Okay, I was going to say, uh, I'm hoping that Snidrian would be so annoyed by my uh, my slime, it wouldn't attack me. But the slime is actually going to help me out anyway, so pretty happy with that. Alright, where's this demon altar at? Where is it? I remember seeing a demon altar. Is it there? I'm really confused now. I can't remember where it is. All right, we got some seashells and some victory shards and a hell of a lot of enemies. Right, I'm going to go find my demon altar. I can't remember where I saw it. I saw it today. Now I cannot remember for the slightest. Oh, it's there. Did I already make it? No. Okay, we're going to go back up. I got confused by the uh, by the Snidrian health bar. But yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of the health bar in Calamity. I think the, the health bar mod is a little bit better. Man, I feel bad for even saying it. So, Armageddon. Makes any hit while a boss is alive instantly kill you. Isn't that already a thing? Isn't that called like uh, the Iron Heart? Effect can be toggled on and off. So, oh, okay. So it's like a one hit thing during a boss, but you don't, um, wait. Okay, I'm really interested in this. Let me read this and figure this out. Makes any hit while a boss is alive instantly kill you. Effect can be toggled on and off. Using this while a boss is alive will instantly kill you and despawn the boss. If a boss is defeated, uh, with this effect active, it will drop 10 treasure bags, 9 in normal mode. Let's make it. 
And what's this? Defiled Ruin. I've never seen that before. I'm going to check that out in a second. But first, I'm going to let my slime kill this. We'll, uh, we'll do a little jump cut here because it's going to take a little while. Unless I die. But that seems really cool. I think I could use that well. Let's see how we do. Look, this could go absolutely dreadfully, let's be honest. But I have a feeling that it won't. Okay. Right, so... Bosses will now instantly kill you. And did I make the crown? I'm kind of confused. I can't see the crown. I'm really confused. Where's the crown? Uh, why is my eyesight terrible today? I'm so confused. Did I put it in here? Oh, it's there. Oh, I already had two of them. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, sorry for being a moron, everyone. I apologize. I actually do. Okay, let's see how this goes. So, to my understanding, this... <laughs> Calamity mod just mugged me off. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. Truly beautiful. Well done, Calamity mod. There has been multiple times where Calamity mod has completely mugged me off, and that is definitely one of them. The other one is when I tried to uh, to beat the system and get the uh, the Reaver Shark. Do you remember that? And it... um. Well, you guys know what happened. You can't use the Reaver Shark. That is so funny. I'm going to set up a little arena and we'll do this fight properly. But oh my god. I don't know if I can actually do this fight now. Huh. We'll see. We'll see. That's so funny though. Well done, Calamity. I love that. I'm glad. Because somebody needed to fix it. Let's be honest. You shouldn't be able to cheese the fight like that. But... <laughs> oh, that made my day. That really made my day. <laughs> All right. Let's give it a round number two. Buff up and we will begin. Give me one second though. My monitor randomly turns off at the minute and it just did it just then. Okay, where are you coming from? Okay, you're here. Let's see if we can do this no hit. You guys can uh, maybe let me know about how many hits we take during the fight. I'm sure you will. Okay. Oh, I forget. The adrenaline charges so slowly when you, when you start off in... Um, Oh, the game? Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, I forget that it's actually really low, isn't it? Like, it takes a long time to get adrenaline. Because that's why uh, Death Mode Slime King is, like, actually kind of, like, a little bit of a challenge. Cool. Oh, wow. Okay, he's right on top of me then. Okay, just give me my adrenaline. There we go. Okay, here we go. Right, I've obviously taken multiple hits this time, so, I mean, no hitting wouldn't have been possible. No, fire, 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 oh my god. I wasted my chance so bad then. Can you please get out of the way? <laughs> there are so many enemies around. If you kill me, I'm a... Ah! God damn. Right. That was a very long fight. We're going to edit that down. But that is going to do it for today's episode, guys. Thank you all for watching. Calamity, I absolutely love you. Please keep kicking my ass like that. It's ace. Um, if you did enjoy today's video, guys, please be sure to leave a like. Um, it goes a long way, and I really, really do appreciate it. And that's about it. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.